Surprise! I know you usually expect to see Erica here. I'm Liza Fromer. I'm standing in for her today because this is her book launch with Rebecca Eckler. They have written a kid's book called The Mischievous Mom at the Art Gallery, and this is the party to launch it tonight in the distillery. So we're going to celebrate, party it up a little bit, and I'm going to go find out what exactly makes a mischievous mom. about this book, that it was a book meant for moms who are working, who don't really need to be feeling any guilt about the fact that they're working, and who want to figure out a way of balancing their commitments at work with their commitments at home. And as all of us in this room know, there is a way to do that. There's a way to do that and still have fun. And it's in um, your hand. And it's in my hand. <laughs> Rebecca called me and said, I would like to write a book with you now that I have a daughter that would really resonate with modern moms. Some sort of a, a story where the moms wouldn't fall asleep when they would read it over and over again. We wrote the book while Jesse and Rowan were in ballet class. So we would meet there at 10 o'clock in the morning and while they were in class, we had about 25 minutes and we would write during that time. And then when they came out of class, we would read it to them and go, what do you think? We use her kids as a test market. Yeah. And if it worked on them, then perfect. The best way to connect with kids is to be mischievous. Because if you're strict, they turn off. But if you work with them and play with them, then you can get them to do anything. What makes a mischievous mom? Who better to ask than the mom matriarch, Erica's mom? So what is it? Knowing that you're a mom up here, but with your heart behaving totally differently, just making sure that whatever you're doing is safe, whatever you're doing is not going to give them bad habits for later on, but go with your heart and play and let them see that life doesn't have to be rules, 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 rules. Somebody who's willing to take risks, somebody who's not afraid to ask questions, and somebody who's fun-loving. I think a mom who breaks the rules, a mom who's not afraid to try something different and new and show that, you know, life isn't a tiny little box. It's a big, big world. I think the essence of a mischievous mom is someone who uh, has their own thing going on, who isn't defined by their momness. Shanann, of course, knows everything there is to know about celebs. So who is a great kind of celeb mischievous mom, do you think? I'm thinking, like, I'm going to say Goldie Hawn probably would have been. I think Goldie Hawn is, like, the gold standard of mischievous moms. Um, Cindy Crawford, I think, is, is an... A nouveau idea of a mischievous mom. I had the opportunity to meet her in Vancouver during the Olympics. And um, in terms of yummy mummy. Yeah, please. She's got it. It's ridiculous. Yeah. She is a mischievous mom. I try. Liza Cromer. 